Malls are constantly trying to reinvent themselves to keep up foot traffic. The ownership group that bought Lakeside Mall in Sterling Heights three months ago is certainly doing that. As Jason Coltharp reports, they're replacing the old Sears store with the furthest thing from another department store. The Lakeside Mall is coming up with some bold new ideas to kind of fill in the empty spaces around the mall, and the biggest of which is going to go where the Sears used to be, right beyond that wall. Really? It's pretty cool. Yeah. <laughs> what these giddy, fast-talking teens are excited about is a new ice skating rink, a modern facility with synthetic ice that will be open year-round. There's like a lot of stores here and then like ice cream just makes it better. I think it's a good idea because like a lot of people like going ice skating like we do. I think it'd be cool because you can do it like year round. It will also feature sound and lighting for what it calls disco skating. I mean, anything to make it a little bit different and kind of keep the indoor mall because I've heard they're possibly like closing it down. So yeah, Partridge Creek is freezing in the wintertime. And if you look around Lakeside, you'll notice a lot of white space. Well, that is changing too courtesy of some local artwork and graffiti artists that will be splashing some new life onto these walls. I think it changes the worst until 2008, but now it's starting to go back. Tony Ansara has had his jewelry store here at Lakeside for 29 years, and he's hoping this move will start another upswing. I hope it gets some more traffic, foot traffic, to bring people back to the mall. Because, you know, this mall had so many ups and downs, that's what happened. So there's no people to rent the mall for three years when they were in bankruptcy. But now they're back to good company bought it. I hope so. And we'll see what they're going to do. The timeline to make this a fun urban shopping environment is moving right along. You're not going to have to wait until next winter for the ice skating rink to be open. They expect to have that ready by this spring. In Sterling Heights, Jason Colthorpe, Local 4. And also in the spring, look for a food truck and pop-up market.